the whole snowpack is just a pile of sugary facets. And throughout our forecast area, we've got weak sugary snow pretty much on every slope has weakened out this entire snowpack. The weak foundation that makes up the snowpack. The is just sugary, weak, fasted snow from top to bottom on pretty much every slope that has snow. And it's just a pile of sugary facets like we've seen much across the whole advisory area. There's really weak snow at the ground and even weaker snow at this interface. We just have facets the whole way. So it's weak. It buried a layer of surface hoar Nice, well-preserved layer of surface hoar on top. Down in a couple pits is this really clear gray stripe of surface hoar that was buried and well-preserved. Doesn't really matter, the snowpack's really weak everywhere. Still is this really weak, sugary junk down at the bottom. We have plenty of. There's a weak layer everywhere. It's all, the entire snowpack is made up of sugary, faceted snow. Snowpack is just all faceted. I mean, it's just weak and what we really need to be careful for is any spots that have a slab of snow. You see teeth on really weak facets. How we trigger collapses down low. We're sitting on top of weak, sugary facets that formed from the snow that fell in October and November. Top of this, this faceted weak junk. So any place where we've got a wind load on top of these facets, and that's where you want to be most careful.